what's going on guys welcome to my channel i am going to talk about classical music the death of classical music should be treated like the tragedy it is let's talk about it When I started listening to classical music, I couldn't stop listening. I have no idea what any of these Italian words meant. I first heard Antonio Vivaldi, The Four Seasons. Bear with me and listen to this. is a group of four violin concertos by Italian composer Antonio Vivaldi, each of which gives musical expression to a season of the year. These were composed around 1718, 1720. If you feel like you want to get to know classical music, give it a try. In my opinion, it is worth it. Let's listen to the sound of the three main instruments. Let's start with cello. Next, the violin. Third one, the piano. It is a different world, isn't it? In this modern society, we rarely talked about classical music. But who are we kidding? Times are changing. However, from my experience, I can tell you why it is beneficial listening to classical music. The positive side effect, it helps me to own a task. It helps me study effectively. According to my research, Classical music decreases your heart rate and anxiety, which helps you focus on the task at the hand and improve memory retention. I myself found classical music very inspiring. However, I have yet been to an opera performance. I also know so little about it. Listen to this and tell me what you think.
globally, data shows 40% of people still listen to classical music. In America, only 35% adults and 29% under 35 years old listen to classical music. The classical era especially refers to music composed between 1750 and 1830, the 17th century, the birth of opera. According to my research, Italians were the first to develop this genre, but the Germans, Austrians, and English so on. If you like this video, feel free to subscribe, like, and share to someone you may know that might be interested in this topic. Thank you for watching.